I was not. Why do you always come all of a sudden? <laughs> because I've been disco dancing at a party and I have. Like, sorry, my voice is really gone. Didn't expect it to go that no. croaky and high. Um, we've woke up. Yeah, we are alive, we're alive still. And kicking. Today we are at sea. It's a little bit grey outside, but it's warm. I've stuck my head outside. It is quite nice. Um, yeah, we're recovering from our hangover now, yep. pretty much. Um, but Gavin's ordered some of the food. The ship yeah, eats. we've got some ship eats. This is kind of cool. So Gavin is gonna he's gonna show us the foods. So it comes in this nice little bag, and it's like on a stand. Do you need a hand? Mm -hmm. What's it in? Like a bucket. Looking very intrigued, borderline confused. I think I went for some toast, didn't I? With like no, Nutella or yeah, something. Oh, wow. Oh my god. Smells good. Oh la la. Oh, I'm going to tuck straight into that. Put your lid on. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. And let's see, what did you go for? What did you go for? And I have gone for. You never told Ready? me. Go on, show me. Oh. Scrambled egg with salmon. It's strange scrambled egg. Is it something special? It looks a bit. <laughs> I'm not sure. <laughs> and the tuckings, I'm it quite smells angry. delicious. Oh wow! So we're going to tuck into these now, anyway. Hi everyone. Welcome to episode six of our Valiant Lady French Days and Ibiza Nights cruise series. This is really good, by the way. Really tasty. How's yours? Very good. Very nice. Loving it. It's really tasty. It's delicious, actually. This is so good. Really works. It doesn't work for my waist. Like good. So we had a lovely, lovely breakfast. It was really, really nice. Um, so today we're on a lazy day. We've had a, a bit of chill. Yeah, we've had a, we've had a lion, a real yeah. nice lion, because we were partying hard last night. Yeah. So we've had a good lion. We've had a breakfast in the room. Yeah, that's all yeah. done and dusted, and it's all put away yeah. in one of them. It's the yeah. same as uh, the other day. We basically see all day, and then we rock up into Ibiza. 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 So I think that's about six, seven p.m. tonight. Yeah. Uh, Gavin has also tried out the laundry stuff. He's yeah. packed a bag for the laundry. The bag laundry ready. Because we've got the blue blazer thing, because we've status match. So we've got, it's one of the picks, you get some laundry. So we've done all of our shit, so we're gonna give it a go because I don't wanna do it when I go home. Yeah. So yeah, and now we're gonna probably go and get a coffee somewhere. Yeah, coffee and then we press a fresh here and we have the spa today, the redemption spa. Yeah. Yeah. We really enjoyed the coffee at the Grounds Club. Having status matched all our previous MSC cruises over to Virgin, we were able to enjoy some deep blue extras, such as a $10 daily coffee tab per cabin. Gavin's getting the coffee. I went for some cookies, by the way. <laughs> so I'll try, try and see what they're like. I think they're like fruit fruit and like oatmeal ones. We'll see. Nice coffee? Um, it's too hot to try. <laughs> okay. Cookies are good. I like them. They're monkey fruit. Look at monkey fruit. <laughs> So, we've just had a coffee, <laughs> and I'm outside. That's nice out here, isn't it? We're gonna go to the back of the ship now, aren't we? Get a bit of fresh air. So now, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to relax at the Redemption Spa. We're gonna make the most of this, aren't we? The thermal area, and enjoy it. On boarding day, we pretty much headed straight to the Redemption Spa to book a spa pass for the thermal area. A three hour spa pass cost $59 per person, which we thought was fairly reasonable. As you can see, there are plenty of facilities on offer, which we took full advantage of and thoroughly enjoyed. Well, maybe not the cold pool so much. Hey, we, we decided, we came back to the room, we were going to have a quick shower because all the mud and stuff we put on our face, but we decided while we were in the room, we might as well just ready. get ready for tonight. And Gavin, this evening, before we leave, quickly, just want to show you his outfit so you get an idea what, what sort of clothes you can wear. I mean, this is quite smart, I think, in fact, very smart. 
but it's really relaxed nice. as well. It's nice and wafty. It's been so lovely this cruise. And I've got, I got, I got a new shirt this time. Do you want to see? Ah, uh, hey, it's this. I'm now sporting the sunflower shirt. Yeah, you should have bought because some I yellow and white that lace. One. He's, I actually bought that for me, but it was too big for me. So I then had to go and buy myself this one because I couldn't buy the same clothes as you, could I? No. Anyway, that, I that, digress. Would look, that would look I, amazing. I digress. Let's go. Let's go. Where are we going, Nick? We have to go up to the roof. That's just 15. I think it's as high as it goes, and then we can go out and we'll have to go up, up the way. So we're at Richard's roof. Top. I keep saying roof, I know what I mean, I know what I mean. Yeah. We're gonna have a nice gin and tonic, aren't we? Yeah. And then we're gonna have some champagne. Then we're gonna go down and see the show, but for now, just taking it. It's really relaxed up here actually, it's so lovely. The sun's come out now as well. In the time we were in the spa, the sun decided to show up. Um, yeah, it's lovely, oh, it's so nice. This is a single, yeah. ready to mingle. Thank you. <laughs> thank you so much, thank you. Thank you. Three Macassi. <laughs> now we're double parked. And you, you forget that a double is not a double British standard measure. Oh, well, that might be actually worth bringing up as well, people, because I was drinking a lot of doubles last night, which could probably explain me. It'll explain why you got so uh, <laughs> merry last night. I see you merry. And, you say merry. and um, it was a very fun night anyway, so you get caught up in the atmosphere. You get excited, yeah. You get drunk. Then I get food, and it just went. <laughs> <laughs> Double park top, we have come prepared. We have just left the roof. We had loads of fun up there. We were talking again, didn't we? Yes. We're in a so bit of a time crunch. We might be late, so we might actually miss the this. The next now. time you see us might be in the show. Because we're we'll just miss it. Oh, oh, here we go. This show does not have an intermission and walking across the stage to exit the theatre is not advised. We are five minutes from showtime, so feel free to stretch your legs or run to the bathroom now. So, 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 we're at the show. We made it just in time. It's really cool. They've configured the whole place differently again. This place is amazing. I've never seen a place, a venue, so versatile as this. It's awesome. Every time we come in, it's a completely different setup, isn't it? It's yeah. brilliant. During our cruise, one of the performances offered was dual reality. This fast-paced, circus-inspired retelling of Romeo and Juliet was absolutely fantastic to watch, and we'd definitely recommend it if it's on your cruise. So we just watched the show, didn't we? And the reality. show was really, really good. And now we're really packaged. So we're gonna go and cluck, cluck, cluck. We're gonna get some of the, the, the wings, the chicken wings from the social club, aren't we? Because we like the social club. So we're gonna go there because they were really good last night. And then, what are we gonna do there? It's all fun now. We are free, we are free. Oh yeah, we go to Ask Kitchen tonight, so stay tuned. So now we are at it's called the, the Craft Social Club. So we play the games, the arcade games, it's really good. And here you also get the chicken wings. We love the chicken wings, don't we? So we'll get some land now. This is really good. We've got popcorn back there. There's a popcorn machine over there. You can see it, it's in your hand there, um, Luke. And we're having the buffalo chicken wings because they're so nice. They're really good. So we enjoy the chicken so much, we've gone for another round. Cluck, cluck, here we go. This time I noticed it's five, but you know it's five, there's only four last time, it's five there. It's really tasty, and the popcorn was delicious by the way, wasn't it? He's tucking, he's tucking into his chicken. Ooh la la, wow, whoa. Welcome to Ibiza, It's so nice, the weather is immense, it's so lovely. It's so perfect. So we're at the dock bar. We get the drinks from there if you want a drink.
we were eating the popcorn, we had some more popcorn we did, didn't we? And we're sat here at the back, it's lovely, look at this. So nice. So lovely, the sun is shining, it's good, look. You see up there, you can see the net. Ooh. <laughs> So, so we've just been at the the dock, the dock, the dock not the dock house, the dock. The dock and house now. is the bar. We're at the dock, and we've been enjoying the scenery, and the sun has been setting. It's absolutely beautiful. And now it's time to use the test kitchen. We have to go to the test kitchen. Come test on. kitchen. People. Tonight we were dining at Test Kitchen, a laboratory style concept pushing your perception of food to a whole new level. What's nice and refreshing about it? The set tasting menus are presented as an ingredients list, but the cooking techniques, presentation and flavours are explored in ways you've never seen. During your dining experience, you also have the option to pair your courses with a selection of set wines or cocktails. Both the wine and cocktail pairings cost $40 each. Both of the wine. You know, I think I'll do a cocktail. I'll try a cocktail, you go for the wine, we can mix and match, right? I think that's the best way to experience it. Yeah, I think I will. Never, no, you might like my cocktails, I might like your wine, we can swap top. We'll just mix it all up, can't we? So this is our uh, appetizer, right? Moose bouche. Moose bouche. Oh, look at this. It's a tuna tart. And the verdict. Nice, experimental, not sure. Is it work? Good, good. Very good, good. Good. Well, it's very fishy, isn't it? Thank you. Very salty. I'd say more like salmon than, than tuna, wouldn't you? It's Good. nice though. So basically what's happened is, people, I've gone for the cocktail uh, taster sample thing and Gavin's gone for the wine. So he's going to try the wine now. Oh, is the wine, is it nice? Is that good? Yes. White wine. Okay, I'll try mine now because this looks uh, intriguing as well. I might get my food once it arrives. Yeah, when it when it arrives, but I just drink the drinks anyway. So it's quite refreshing. I think he said soda, didn't he? You would probably like that quite a lot. So our like appetizer has arrived, which is like the corn. So obviously it looks like sweet corn, not proper sweet corn. We also have some bread as well. So this sweet corn stuff is absolutely delicious, but what happens is, right? You have to butter your bread with it, don't you? Which you can imagine will really work, because it does, yeah? Yeah, I think so. This is lovely. This is so, honestly, this is really good. Luke's enjoying himself. Thumbs up. It's really, really, no, honestly, I'm gobsmacked. It's really, really tasty. Like, so There's good. only one course in. Our second cocktails have come, so I don't know what mine was. You've got a rose. So, what we're doing tonight, as you know, we're doing a cocktail package versus wine package. This is absolutely delicious. I've already, I've already had a go with that. Leave me some. That's better than that. Yeah. That's way better. And how's your salmon? Well, I haven't tried it yet, have I? Ooh, that's smoky, but it's cracking. I like that. Do you, do you like the beetroot? Do you like the beetroot? I like the beetroot. It's probably alright. What's, what's the So our drinks arrived and this is like a ginger, did you say it was like a ginger what? It's like a gingery, it's like a gingery it's like cocktail. Like white one. And he's got another white wine. This is quite nice, it's good. It tastes very like like the nature. Like the like the earth, like a, like sap from a tree and stuff. It's like oh, lovely. very earthy, isn't it? What your wine? Your, you know, your um, cocktail. Oh nice, he's tried it for me, that's, that's, that's rude. So it's like a ginger spritzer, right, you said? Mm. 
with lemon. Got a lemon. Yes, thank Ooh. you. That's nice. Very nice, isn't it? So our main has arrived and we have the lamb, which looks and smells incredible. It looks really, really good. Yeah. Do you have a new cocktail? A new cocktail as well. Oh, okay, because what happened was I'm wearing half my last course. The beetroot is splattered all over my top, so I had to rush to the toilet and scrub it off, didn't I? It's my matic roll, but it's real. Oh, what's with the what's with this? It looks interesting. Have you got another red? Have you got a red wine now? They're only giving you little drags of wine though, aren't they? They don't really like full on glasses. That looks pretty rare to me, I've got to be honest. That looks very rare, people. But as long as it tastes good and it's to your liking, that's what it matters. How do you find it? Is it good? Yeah? Nice. Very good. He's happy, he's happy, people. That sauce is banging. Which sauce? It's oh, Oh, the gravy. Ooh. Ooh. These knives are pretty cool. Look at the handles. They're awesome, aren't they? So this is medium, which I'd say it is medium, isn't it? So you said the gravy's really good, right? The gravy's really good. That is very good. I, I thought the gravy and lamb goes really well. Enjoy. So the lamb's going down really well. How is your cocktail, Luke? Try your cocktail. Actually, I haven't tried it. I've been really enjoying it. Go, go for it. Try it now. Sorry, that's good gravy with a bone. It's that good. Be careful what with your gravy. You've already yeah, had no, that beetroot already over had here. Instant with the beetroot. So, so what did they say this was called? I can't remember. Ginger, I think. Again? Yeah. I don't think the last one was ginger. Yeah. There's no ginger. That's apple. Apple, okay. Apple. Apple. So, I'd say yours. On this occasion, your red wine goes better with this course than this. My cab sav. Yeah, this goes be better with Paul. Your lamb, your lamb is beautiful, is it? Lamb's absolutely gorgeous, and the gravy's beautiful. Zhu, zhu. Gravy. So we're starting double fist here because they're stuck in there. Oh. Yeah. You mean we got a car park? Well, yeah. No, no, no. My car's already crashed. My car's already gone. It's a write off. So. This one here, folks, is a St. Louis Rosé. And you like that, don't you? You like the Rosé. I've drinking the St. Louis Chauvin. Uh, this one, we don't know what the hell is in this. He said it was strong. Try it, try it. Oh, yeah. so, I haven't tried it yet, we'll give it a go. That's not strong. That's all right. Heavy, but it's not strong. I say it's more heavy than alcohol. -y. Okay. So now, people, we are waiting for our next course, which is going to be the asparagus, which apparently is like a sorbet. We've been told because we've seen it in the video. Is that like a pudding course then? Or is it pre pudding. Like pre pudding. Oh, let's see. Let's see. So this is the asparagus sorbet, like a ginger and a champagne kind of custardy kind of thing. How is it? Weird. Weird. But it works. But it works. As long as it works, are you happy? Good. Let's see I'm more intrigued by the custard I am. That's weird. But it works, doesn't it? I it's weird, it's, but it works. No, like cold asparagus ice cream would, would that work? But it works. It does, doesn't it? But then say like green tea ice cream, I don't think it, it that doesn't does it for this, uh, well, this this maybe this custard saves it. No, that's that's nice. Really nice. So this is an old fashioned which is like a if you've never had it before, it's like a like a whiskey with a amaretto, which is like a di serrano, like a mixture. And, um, I think it's smoked cinnamon. Well, right, there's definitely cinnamon in that, people. It's definitely cinnamon in it. And uh, your next drink is a. I think you said is that moscato? Yeah, it's sweet wine. Yeah, that would make sense to be fair, because we're having this lovely luxurious pudding, which we have to now mix it's it all up. It's strawberry. It's strawberry. We have to mix it all up. They look like winders, don't they? Remember the winders? We used to have them on our diet, like as a snack, but 
Yeah, they look like winders, and these like loads of like pop, 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 look at the bubble things. Like, pop, 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 it's, like, it's fun. So we will show tuck in now, and it should be fun. So after we go like this, set, set to mix it all up. Right, so mix, mix, mix. Ooh. 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 Ooh, mate. Ooh. Trying. And that's like salted caramel popcorn in there. Oh, what's this little, I want to know what this little squidgy thing is. I mean, I'm going to try it, people. I'm going to try it. Come on, you little bugger. Mmm. That works. Good. Mmm. So we've just had an exceptional meal at the test kitchen. Very good. It really surprised me actually, people. I like I was absolutely blown away. Some of the stuff I think won't work actually really, really works. We've had some like really, really, really good. Yeah, who would have thought asparagus sorbet would work, but it worked. The beetroot course was nice. You you weren't too far. That's my least favourite course. Before. My favourite was probably I love the the sweet corn starter, that was absolutely awesome. And I also really, really like the, the lamb I had my mate. And the pudding, well, that's all that's left. Wasabi. That, with the wasabi. wasabi was really, really good. So come here with an open mind because the food is absolutely awesome. And you'll taste it. There are two menus, so you can come here twice. Yeah. Come at the start and the end, you cruise and you get the menu. It's definitely, but I, I, I really like this menu. It was really good. I was apprehensive, but I'm glad I've come. <laughs> So oh, we are back, we are back in our room. We are back in our room and we've got it on getting it on mode, which is all this red kind of bow, 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 bow. We're not getting it on, we're, we're going off getting, into no, Ibiza. We're getting, on. We're, get, we're getting it off, we're getting it off the ship are we. Let's what go. are we doing now? We're going to Whoa, we're, we're going, going to, to Ibiza. Ibiza. <laughs> Whoa. Back to the island. Pop pop pop. So anyway, <laughs> once Luke stops dancing. Um, we're going to get off board now. Off and board, off the ship. Off the ship, on board, off board, off, off board, board. Off we're board's going, a word. We're off getting board. off. We're going to disembark. Disembark the ship. Yeah, and then... We're going to go to Ibiza the whole time. Have, oh. a, have a drink or two. Yeah, a get some nice little photos of the ship. Let's go, let's go. We've got a shuttle go. bus. We've got to go to Ibiza. So we've got off our ship and now we're on our ship and we're going to go into town. Let's go, let's go. We're at Ibiza. Back to the island. So we've just got off our shuttle and we are officially... We're at Ibiza people. Ibiza, Ibiza, Ibiza. Ibiza. We're going to find somewhere to go. We'll find, I'm sure we'll go. We're just going with the flow, but we'll find somewhere to go. <laughs> See the shops there. And we've got like a castle or something up there. And there's loads of taxis. So yeah, basically we, we, we're here. We've just rocked up. Oh, and over on the other side over there, you can see the ship and it says I love Ibiza on it, which is really awesome actually. And there's a plane as well in the sky. And that's coming down now. There it goes. We're by the ocean, by the marina. You can see our ship. Our ship, our ship is over there. You see all the boats, all the lights, all the pretty things. And the... look at this, look at this, people. This is lovely, isn't it? It's kind of like being in Miami. Slightly. Has Miami vibes. I'm following you, I'm following you. Here he is, he's very busy. Oh, look who it is, look who it is, hello. So we're at our first bar and I've eaten it. We are at da Dado Bar. He's there. He's got a drink. Happy, happy. I went for a. What did you go for? Some sort of cocktail, I can't remember. I forgot that.
Okay, we've been drinking the drinks, we've had loads of fun. We've been in Ibiza, we have. We're in a bar, there's Gavin, he is there. And now, now, sorry people, we didn't video all of us talking rubbish. Well, there's no point talking. There's no about. point, loads of fun though. It's been really great now, isn't it? It's been amazing. so much fun. <laughs> We're having so much fun on this cruise, right? It's a Ray Toot. <laughs> in your mouth, look, in your mouth. <laughs> you wanna watch me gobble on this? <laughs> <laughs> That's for personal use. Yeah, yeah. Rough <laughs> mm. That was the worst timing ever. He literally drove away because he saw us coming. I mean, I can't say I blame him, but we. He literally just saw us and went, fuck this, and he's gone, and he. So we are on the bar, the bar. So That's home. And now we're going home. We've been at the bar. We have. We've been at the bar. And the the, the, the yeah, beef. It might be three o'clock in the morning. It's like half past three. It is. The bar. Ooh. <laughs> it's fun. Ta-da! I'm back in the room, I'm back in the room. Gavin's just gone to the buffet, he has. He's going to get us some food. I'm really tired, I'm really like a wedding bleeding. I'm so sleepy. It's been loads of fun though. We went to Ibiza and we were like around the old town. Tomorrow we're hoping to go back, by the way, because obviously we're here for a whole other day. So we really hope you've enjoyed this video today, our little adventures. If you have, please give it a thumbs up. If and if you've really enjoyed it please 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 consider subscribing to our channel that'd be awesome and we'll see you in the next adventure so bye night thanks for watching